Hey guys, how's it going? The Haggard Nerd here. Welcome back to No Man's Sky. Last episode, uh, we made it to this planet here, and uh, we found this little station, and I'm going to talk to Dude. Uh, we are currently on the hunt to make a circuit board. We have one heat capacitor. We worked on that last episode. We're now working on polyfiber. Polyfiber re fiber requires star bulbs and cactus flesh. Um, I honestly do not know how to find cactus flesh, but uh, this planet here has star bulbs, so I'm hoping maybe you guys know how to find cactus flesh. Uh, and then you'll let me know, and then uh, <laughs> we'll be able to do this without me having to hop out and look. But um, for right now, we're just we're just gonna hang out here and talk to dude and see what's going on. Ooh, that's pretty. We got two million three hundred ten thousand. Oh, class B though. Twenty three slots. Can I just can I just take it? I mean, is that is that a thing I can do? That'd be nice. Let's see if we can sell some stuff. All right, we can get rid of a Gek Charm, Corvax, holding on to the Frost Crystal of Viking, holding on to that, even though that's, man, maybe I should just start making a bunch of heat capacitors, but not sell them here because they're like 10% less than the galactic average. What else do we have? Also holding on to the selenium. Get rid of the carbon so I don't need that in my inventory. All right, cool. Barren planet. Barren planet is where you find uh, the cactus stuffs. Hey, buddy. Oh, you're 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 pretty, dude. <laughs> uh, something something Viking. Okay. The warrior seems to greet me, but does so with a noticeable lack of energy. Their movements are slow, and their eyes struggle to focus. Uh, these guys don't like to get touched, but why not? Very relaxes, but says nothing. I should leave them to rest. All right. Cactus slush is on desert biomes. Scan planets. Much space to find it. All right. Now, will it literally say desert? Or what's outside? Is this also outside? Eh. Okay. Oh, it's so messy out here. Am I? I'm, I'm gonna have to ride out the storm before I can go search around here. This is ridiculously hot around here. I'm hoping I can get into one of these and look around. There we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was kind of ridiculous. So a few there. There's some uh, carbon there. Oh, hello. Okay. Oh, uh, 99, 92, 86, 81. Okay. So th these, there's patterns to this. So 9988, uh, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99. 86, 87, 88, 89, 91, 92, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86. So that's reducing by two each time. So uh, 987. <laughs> so 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92. Okay, that's six. Uh, 81 to 86 is five. So the next one would be four down. So 81, 80, 79, 78, 77. All right, cool. Okay. Um, waypoint detected. Three. Didn't really show me. Oh, crash ship. Okay, cool. Uh, maybe we'll go check that out because I've been wanting a new ship for a while. And this would be a great chance to go check that out. See what else is in this area, though. That's the other main, or the main location. I'm gonna hop over to this building here. See what this is. Storm's supposed to be clearing, man. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of stuck. Okay, here we go. Oh, uh, Torvok, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. There we go. Hey, 
Hey, buddy. Okay, something interloper. Viking warrior. Okay. Warrior's facial markings draw to a smirk as it looks me up and down. I feel like I'm being sized up as a potential combatant. Creature points to an intriguing blueprint on screen and points to their own face. I'm being goaded into punching them. Then, uh oh. Oh, that's a miss. I think that's a typo. The life form barks menacingly. It's clear that this action will result in swift retribution. Uh, let's do it. Warrior strikes back with astonishing force. They bark out laughter before handing me the blueprint. Okay. Pulse spitter damage sigma. Interesting. Okay. Good F. I know I took damage, but it's fine. It's fine. Is there health on the walls or anything like that? Yeah, these guys are all about violence and stuff. So, might as well. Let's see what this is. Like maybe an hour last week between your videos, I found an Atlas V3 pass. Does that open one and two? I think it does all three, but I could be wrong. Okay, so we got another pattern here. Uh, judging by the imposing size and the weapon shown on the identification ID image. It's like saying the same thing twice. Uh, that glares at me as I boot up the system. Station's overseer must have originated from a warrior's race. A warrior race. Life form probably left long before the arrival of the beacon that now winks tantalizingly next to it. Okay. If I can enter the correct code, perhaps I can learn secrets. So five nine nine two oh five. Okay, so it's all the this is the same four numbers. So five nine two. So I'd assume the next one needs to start with a five. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna assume it's that one. Because none of the characters are in the same locations. Let's do that. Number enter has no effect. Oh no! Well poop. Okay. Well darn. I did not give that one enough time. Eh. <laughs> I'm slightly ashamed of that. Okay, let's go check out that uh that crash ship. A little bit of a tangent from what I was trying to do before. We'll get there though. Okay, I gotta wait for my jetpack so I can climb up on this. There we go. Okay, let's just go ahead and discard that. Alright. Incoming storm. Another one! Let's go sell the Viking dagger and stuff. Yuji, what's up, buddy? Okay, if I keen, let's get rid of that one. I think that is it. Indeed, okay. I was at, like, on another planet? Oh, no, 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 it's just, it's just a thing with a pointer. Oh, no. Oh, no, I'm going to hit that thing. I'm totally going to hit that thing. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay. Okay. I can't see you through this all, all this storm stuff going on. Oh, no, we got a safari hat. Okay. I'll get you as soon as I land. I'll get you as soon as I land, man. <laughs> I think uh, this is the official first hat purchase. I could be wrong. But I think that's the case. Numbers just moved up. Oh, okay. I cannot see anything. I'm gonna have to uh, like go up and then come back down. there I know beeper thing this is why I put the beeper thing on so that way it remind me that something needs to happen and pull up just a little bit well that's good Uh, 
I'll get you. I'll get you. Anton, it's just a fun thing uh, to kind of recognize those that hang out a lot. I'm sorry to hear that, Dennis. Welcome back, though. Gonna jump up again one more quick time. Here we go. Alrighty, so we've landed. And as per Torvox request, we got a uh, safari hat here that's gonna happen. This is gonna be silly, but uh, you know that's that's the point. This is fun. It's meant to be fun. It's gonna have to go over. Oh Jesus! It's gonna have to go over my uh, <laughs> my headphones. It's, it's gonna have to do. It's gonna have to. It's gonna have to be like that. I don't know how this is gonna work otherwise. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I guess I guess we'll do the clipped things. Uh, it won't take too much longer. Almost there. Almost there. Has to be. Oh, so weird. So weird. Okay. I may actually have to change out my my my, my headphones for like instances like this. But uh, this is gonna have to do for now. So uh, this is the uh, the safari hat. And uh, congratulations, Trevok, for having been the first purchase of a hat. As awkward as it is, it's fine. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to get like other headphones for hats. Cause this is not gonna work. It's learning the experience here. Oh hi, I was just about to. Uh, you guys are weird looking. Give me some plutonium here. I'm not trying to hurt you guys. You guys are weird. Oh hello, you're a cool looking little ship. I would really, really like it if you had a lot of slots and you were A-rated. Probably not the case, but uh, one can hope. Warp cell. Oh, man, that was good. Almost got the top hat instead. I thought it looked better in the spar hat. All right, man. That's all good. All right, let's see what's going on here. Alrighty, so I'm greeted by the stench of rotting flesh as I enter the derelict vessel's Spartan interior. A huge beast dressed in what appears to be a military uniform lies where it died, mere feet from the escape hatch. Behind it is a partially smashed rack of military multi-tools secured by a sparkling alien locking mechanism. The cockpit door hangs slightly ajar and I can see operational equipment inside. Um, let's try to take the multi-tool. Literally, she shoots through me as the damaged alien device sputters in protest. But I find within somewhat compensates for my pain. Ooh. Ooh. Well, it's, I mean, it's a C, but it's got 19 slots. And it's free, right? I'm currently using an A with 10. I will get an increase in damage. With a slight decrease in scanning. Um... I would not mind to have those extra slots. Can I can I move these things over? Can I... Oh crap! Uh oh oh man oh man um. Shit. <laughs> okay okay. Oh crap! Did I did I just lose that? I probably just lost it. The uh, the storm is not allowing me to think through this as thoroughly as I'd like, but I need to get back to my ship before I die. Exactly, that's the point. Trying to get back to my ship. Okay, we're gonna have to hang out for a second while this storm clears. Nope, not that one. Okay, let's just do it this way. Uh, that one is recharging. It's doing fine. Life support is okay we're, we're actually fine okay we're just gonna hang out here for a minute 
I have the blue Colonial Viper looking ship. It's not combat upgraded. Live it as many slots. It takes two to three hours to fill up with gold. Oh, okay, nice. Reaper, hey, what's up, buddy? Uh, it's it's just like super hot. I, I don't know what the uh, the status of this planet is, but it's not very it's not very good for my health. I'm trying to think if I had any other headphones just sitting around, but I do not. The other headphones are upstairs. So I'll just I'll just deal with that later. It'll be fine. It's good. What is that? Okay, that's not what I'm looking for. Okay, so storm gone, man. Seriously, intense heat burst. Yeah, still doing the, uh, still doing the storm thing. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait up. Look out for flying blocks. Absolutely, absolutely. Let's see. Here. I feel like maybe I could like pull this down a little bit further. There we go. Not really worth it. Cost you as much to fix these slots as to buy a fresh mini outpost. Oh, yeah, that's true. You mean you're talking about the multi tool, right? We haven't looked at the ship yet. Quick dig a hole, yeah, right? That's green, it's like chocolate green. Except when you try to drink it, it burns you inside out. You're not incorrect. I, I, would, I would think that that would be an accurate description. <laughs> uh, of course, chocolate green is it's an old school meme right there. Uh, just waiting, just waiting. I hate waiting. I'm impatient, man. But I can't really do much about it. Ah, uh, the multi-tool. Okay, cool. All right, we're going to continue hanging out here. I'm going to continue wearing my fancy hat. <laughs> and uh, as soon as the storm clears, we will hop over and check out the uh, the ship. This is really bad timing here. This is like the longest storm ever. Looks like it's clearing. Is that is that accurate? I mean, maybe it's just the lighting changing from uh, going from day to night or something. <laughs> that is the appropriate me uh, emoji there, Chris. Well played. Okay, can I just hop out? I mean, we're still doing the thing. It still sounds like it's doing the thing. Here we go. Okay, well, let's see what we got here. I mean, if it's similar, I may go ahead and pat, uh, do it anyway. So this is the 24 slots. It's a class C compared to our A rated class A. Uh, a rated class A, yeah, that, that makes sense. Uh, a rated uh, hauler. But I mean, it would be a fighter. Uh, we have 31 versus 24 slots. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know if it's worth it. Because, I mean... Is that is that something we want to do? Fighter costs less. I mean, I don't want to lose the slots, and I don't want to lose the class. So, that was kind of a waste, unfortunately. Alright, well, too bad question though if we were to do tech if we found some more iron we could maybe find another ship now the thing is I thought I used the signal booster before and I thought that it did not give me the option of finding any ships Hello, Emerald. Don't mind if I do. I wish I could strip it for parts. Uh, that would be really nice. Um, I don't think that's a thing, but I will go check that out. Maybe it's something that changed. Or maybe it's been a mechanic that I was just not aware of this entire time. I've been missing a lot of money. <laughs> All right, 
to compare. So if I were to... Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I mean, unless there was more to it than that, but... I did not see the way... Alright, let's try to that, that beacon thing. Need one more iron. Oh, man. Okay, give me ship. Give me ship. Nope, neither one of those are ships. But a drop pod wouldn't be bad. Thank you for subscribing, Reaper. Welcome, welcome. That's how you suggest things in the game rather than trying to tell Haggard what to do. Absolutely, absolutely. Like, like you guys have been super helpful versus like straight up telling me what to do. <laughs> it's a matter about approach, really, really. Best place for ships is or was a freighter that costs money. Hmm. And looks at other Factorio and others. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. I try to produce the best content I can. I know it's not for everybody, but I do the best I can. And as time goes, I'll get better. Another storm. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I'm all about some Factoria, though. Question is, do I have enough? <laughs> Absolutely, Reaper. Absolutely. So, 60. Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, and if uh, Reaper, if you're if you're into Discord, man, um, got a Discord community, you might enjoy. Just uh, kind of a cool place for us to hang out outside of streams. That's where I usually like get your feedback and stuff, run ideas by everybody, just, and just kind of hang out and stuff. I'm on the I'm on there during the days mostly. All right. Well, um, that wasn't quite as awesome as I had hoped. Let me let me see what we're working with here, though. So, still need star bulbs, <laughs> and we still got to find these in between uh, in between storms. So, oh my gosh. Cool. Appreciate it, man. Let's try a cargo slot at the next pod. More storage since you just call cargo. Oh, okay. Um, are you talking about like the additional like auxiliary slots? I've not really messed with those like I should have. That's a relatively new thing to me. They didn't have that at the launch of the game. Uh oh, What's up, Tyler? How's it going, buddy? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm doing it every other week. I'm alternating on Fridays between this and Astroneer. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll try to remember that cargo slot, though. Oh, that's what I was seeing. Okay. I was seeing something. I just didn't know what. Am I going back to the downship? Uh no. Uh it, it was it was a C class with less slots and less value, so I'm just gonna pass on it. I'd like to find something at least comparable to what I have now that's a fighter class. I'm kind of still waiting out this storm here. Or maybe I could just run around like crazy for a second. I'm really just trying to find a couple of 
the things I need. Uh, the star bulbs. Something there. Oh, oh, oh. I'll take whatever you have. Yeah, this is not working out. Yeah, this is not working out at all. Okay, let's uh do the ship call thing. Um. Oh no! Oh, no! Is it? Is it out? Oh crap! Okay, I got. I got. I got to head back then. I'm a gonna die. Is this how I'm gonna die? I think this is gonna be how I die. I got nothing. Okay. Okay. Just gotta run. Just gotta run. Oh man. I got that. I'm. I'm trying to fix that right now. Oh man, this is not working out. Okay, well that <laughs> I learned my lesson there. <laughs> oh dang, that was rough. That was very rough. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna give it just a second. And what did I not have any? I don't know why it wouldn't 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 come to me. So I had fuel in my thrusters. Very friendly planet with hardly any storms. It's clear all day long. It's very nice. Oh, oh, oh. I was trying to pull up and it was not enough, apparently. Let's go right here. This looks nice. That was close. It's closer than I'd prefer. Very closer than I'd prefer. There's plenty of emerald on this planet. Or maybe that's not emerald. There's something on this planet. Yeah. Oh, oh, there we go. I just had to just do it, yeah. Definitely just had to just do the thing. You gotta do the things when you can do the things, man. Else, how would you experience the things that the, the life has for you, man? <laughs> Alright, let's see what's going on here. Alright. Ancient knowledge passed down through generations of Viking warriors spills from the marker stone, filtering into my mind like a long forgotten memory. Seek help with the language. Let's do that. All right, security. Okay, cool. <laughs> nice. Nice. All right, let's see if we can find some more of the stuff we're looking for. Plutonium or platinum, rather. Not seeing any of the star bulbs, though, unfortunately. Seeing a crap ton of emerald everywhere, though. I wonder if I should be spending time picking some of this up since there's so much of it. It might be worth it, to be completely honest. And I think that might be what we're looking for over there. Yeah, maybe we'll spend a little bit of time collecting this, because we do need some funds. Oh, man. Okay. Well, let's, uh, let's do something about that, then. So let's go ahead and transfer to that because we can probably do that. We can do that, and maybe we can do this. Nope. And then what about that? Nope. What about that? Plutonium? Yes. Power canister. Just go ahead and get rid of the carbon. Let's 
move that with the other emerald. There we go. See it pick it up, you never know. Plus, it's good for cash. Yeah, absolutely. I'm starting to think, though, that I might farm those, um... These heat capacitors for a little bit. Because we found the selenium and the frost work pretty easily. And that was like 225,000, something like that. It was definitely a six digit number that I was quite impressed with. Is this what I need? No, that looks like zinc. That is zinc. What's up, Coop? How's it going? Yeah, uh, so Torvok purchased the safari hat thing so yeah that's what's going on there oh oop, there we go Ooh, hello don't mind if i do all right viking word for enemy sounds dangerous Okay, guys, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. Next episode, we will continue with this final episode of the evening. And there's another thing over there I need to hit. Uh, but guys, if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. If you like what I do, hit the like button. Uh, if you want to help my channel grow, guys, share my videos, share my live streams, leave likes, leave comments, all that good stuff. The more you guys participate, the bigger we grow. and definitely want to do that. So definitely appreciate all the support you guys give me every single day. Thank you guys so much. You guys rock. And uh, if you're ever on the Twitch or the Mixer side, make sure you hit the follow button too as well. Appreciate it. And guys, just a heads up, we got a giveaway going on. So make sure you check the link in the description for more information. So guys, I will catch you in the next episode. As always, thanks for watching. Take care.